Hi guys, Lisa Hall with Lisa Hall Realty. I want to share with you today my top five reasons why homes linger and stay on the market for too long. First, let's clarify that we are in a seller's market. Homes are selling fast. In June of 2019, in Pinellas County, Florida, here where I live, um, homes, uh, the average days that the home stayed on the market was 28 days. So they are selling fast. Uh, sometimes we see homes stay on the market for weeks and maybe even months when they don't have to. There are reasons why this happens and I want to share with you uh, my reasons why I think that happens. Uh, reason number one, the price is too high. Uh, a home will sell uh, if it doesn't matter the location um, or the condition of the home if the price is right. Um, a buyer will expect uh, a price on the home to be discounted if the home is in need of repairs or if it's outdated uh, paint colors and that sort of thing. Um, if we price the height, if we price the house for too high, and we gradually see the price, you know, the seller will gradually lower the price and now it's been on the market for a while, uh, the buyers will sometimes stay away from that. Now it's kind of got a stigma, it's got a flag, like what's wrong with this house? And sometimes they will, don't even want to look at the house. So it's very important to price the house right to begin with when it first goes on the market. Uh, the second reason why homes stay on the market for too long is that it's too dark. When a buyer comes into a home, they, they don't want to see uh, drapes that are closed. They don't want to see dark colors, dark paneling, dark leather furniture. Uh, we want to brighten up the house. So I always suggest to sellers to paint those cabinets white, open up the blinds, let the light in. Uh, sometimes just the matter of you know, making it more inviting um, and very bright when somebody walks in will help the home to sell quicker. Uh, the third reason why homes may stay on the market too long is that the photos on the internet are bad. Uh, sometimes a seller will take their own photos if it's a for sale by owner or an agent uh, may take the photos with their iPhone for example, but uh, in our firm here we always take uh, professional photos, drone shots that can make a huge difference when marketing the property online for sale. That's the first thing people see are these photos online, right? Okay, the uh, fourth reason is that the home may be outdated and the price does not reflect it. So we wanna make sure that if the home, let's say it needs a new air conditioner, it's a, it has a roof repair that it needs, or you know, the, the end of the life of the, of the roof is coming up soon, we wanna reflect the price with those things so that a buyer coming in will go, okay, I can budget this amount of money uh, for these things after I get the home, uh, if they know that they're getting the home at the right price in the current condition that it's in. The fifth reason that a home may linger on the market is it may be uninsurable. Especially in our state of Florida, uh, the, we have to pass what we call a four point inspection uh, for the home to be insurable. And that means that the roof, the electrical, the plumbing, and the heating and air conditioning system need to be in workable and in good condition. So if those things if we don't meet those conditions, then the home may not be insurable, which makes the home harder to sell. So I, I'm so happy to share those things with you today. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video, and I will see you next time.